people of the southern Nigeria have lost their true identity to some reasons that will be highlighted below. The southern part of Nigeria was formerly known as the Southern Protectorate during the colonial era. The Southern Protectorate covered all the coastal areas of the present-day Nigeria. This protectorate was established in the early 1900 by the Royal Niger Company. The region comprises mainly of the Yoruba, Igbo, Ibibio, Edo, Ijo languages. There was nothing like the Southeast, South South, Niger Delta, or the Southwest. You are either South or North. There was nothing like the Southeast, South South, Niger Delta, or Southwest. You are either South or North. No part of the world operates with such zoning system like that of Nigeria. According to Mazi Namdekano and a proper research, the southern Nigeria was amalgamated with the northern Nigerian protectorate to make the single colony of Nigeria in 1914. The union was done for economic reasons and not political. The, the northern protectorate always have a budget deficit in operation in order to cut short of such deficit, they had to align with the surplus of the Southern Protectorate. This has been the case. Since then, later, since, the, since then, later metamorphosed into present day Nigeria. In reference to Mazi Nambekano and Pa Ayo Adebanjo, they have referred to this union as not original as a result of its products and dividends. While the Southern colonial administrators saw the amalgamation as an opportunity for total expansion, the Northern counterparts believed that it was unhealthy to the interests of the areas they administered because of their common backward growth. They, the Northern colonial administrators, saw it as their duty to resist and counter the advancement of Southern influences and culture into the North. The Southerners, on their own, were not ready to welcome the expansion of legislature, which was originally meant for the North. Even Alpha, after amalgamation, there has been only two zones in the colony which was the southern and the northern colonies. Geopolitical zones became effective under late General Sani Abacha, which according to the then government was to enhance allocation formula. Prior to the zoning of Nigeria, it had, it had three regions, excluding the Midwest. Those regions were the northern, undivided, just as before Almadamation, the eastern and the western regions, which were both part of the now divided southern province of the Royal Niger Coastal Company. After the civil war that broke out from 1967 to 1970, a new approach was laid down to weaken the strength of the southern part of Nigeria especially the East, the now defunct Biafra. Mazi Namdekano had stated in his broadcast how zoning was used to create a stronghold on the whole southern region through the divide and rule approach. He further explained how the creation of states weakened the South and most other ethnic nationalities that seemed to be threats to the core Arewa North. In his explanation, he revealed that many Igbo-speaking tribes have been divided into the North through the creation of states. 
this making an Igbo ethnic group become a northerner. He highlighted states like Kogi and Bene State as to where you can find such acts. He explained that there was no identity called Niger Delta or South South, stating that it is either you are a southerner or a northerner. He explained that there was no identity called Niger Delta or South South, stating that it is either you are a southerner or a northerner. He highlighted how the political elites in the north have used this method to siphon power to themselves, claiming that in the democracy, the majority wins the vote. He clearly explained how this has stampeded the whole south where the country feeds from in growing economically or structurally. Mazi Nandekano clearly mentioned that the result in this attack on the South has made them remove the bite of Biafra from the current map. In reaction to these stated facts, a Twitter user who's, who is from the present inoculation called South South or Niger Delta has agreed to this fact stating, I am an indigent of River State that was created by Nigeria. I don't believe the word South South and Niger Delta. There's nothing like that in the geography of the world. It's only a fake identity to divide us, the Biafrans. Mazi Namdekano clearly stated the notion of being Southeast South South, Niger Delta, or Southwest. He said it's either your Odudua or Biafra from the South, insisting that there should be no more divisions among the Southerners, while the Northerners are instigating and prospering from their losses. All right, guys, what are your thoughts concerning this particular new story as it were? Do you agree with what Namdekano has said? That there should be no, um, there should be no more divisions like southeast, southwest, south this, south south, Niger Delta, what have you. It is a co combination, a synergy of the south, the way it has been right from the beginning or even before amalgamation. But it is what it is. I don't know if people of today will admit and agree to this. Um, idea. It remains to be seen. But what are your thoughts, guys? Well, drop by at the comment section. Let's know what your thoughts are. Don't forget to subscribe to this channel if you are yet to subscribe. Kindly hit the bell icon so you can get notification whenever we post new stories. Endeavor to share these new stories with your friends, family, relations, and loved ones so they can get to know what is happening around the world and be informed. Thank you so much, guys. I appreciate your support, and I'll see you on the other news. Thank you and bye for now.